So last episode, I talked to you guys about wanting to complete the requirements for the Hard Mauritania Diaries. Well, one skill I need to level up is Construction, and that is what I want to do first. A bird's nest? I don't want that. Um, the first skill I want to do is Construction. Now, I don't need to get all the way to level 50, but that's what I would like to do. At level 50, I can mount a glory, and I can put some portals on my house, which will be really, really useful. So, um, this is what I'm doing for construction. I don't know if this is the fastest method. I did a lot of research, and this is kind of what I came up with, with, you know, what seems to be the best idea. Um, I'm not high enough level to use the plank make spell. So, what I'm doing, though, as you can see, I'm chopping oak logs right here, which are very conveniently located next to this hot air balloon. Uh, my inventory, I have money and a single wi willow log. The willow log is for the uh, the journey over there. It's like a fee. So basically what I'm doing, I'm going to run here, chop a full inventory of oak logs. Then I'm going to use the hot air balloon. Uh, this takes you literally right next to the sawmill. So I'll we'll just do this quickly. You go to the sawmill and then you talk to this dude, make some planks. And conveniently enough... As I said, those oak, those oak trees are really conveniently located. So once I'm done with the inventory like that, I just teleport to Castle Wars with a Dueling Ring. Uh, grab another Willow Log and bada boom, there you go. I imagine this is actually going to be pretty fast planks. I need to get about 1500 stored up, which is going to cost like 300k GP, so rip my cash deck. But uh, this is what I'm doing. If you have any better advice, I guess for the future, let me know. But this seems pretty solid. Alright, let me just uh, throw this refrigerator down, and boom, there we go. There is 50 construction already, I am blown away by how fast this skill is, seriously. Like, I knew it was fast, but holy crap, man, that is insane. I mean, it probably took me a couple hours to bank 1500 oak planks, and then it took me like an hour and a half to get all these levels, so this was surprisingly quick. Uh, now at 50 construction, I can build a portal room, I can build an altar, and I can mount a glory. All of those things are very expensive, but are things that I need to do and are going to help me a lot. So, uh, let's get our house set up real quick. Wow, so that absolutely destroyed my cash stack. As you can see, I have 26k, but uh, definitely worth it. Uh, so, we now have an altar, a mounted aim of the glory, and a couple of teleports. Now, for now, I only put in the Carol teleport and the Varrock teleport. I have no idea to put in this third one because... These two are by far the most useful. Um, and obviously, they're all useful, but... You know, considering my current cash deck, I'm going to prioritize these two. And eventually, I'll uh, probably make another portal room and I'll try and get all the teleports. But anyways, guys, I'm surprised that, you know, I waited this many episodes to do this. Because having all of this stuff in here is very, very important. But anyways, that's construction done for for the episode. Um, I'm going to take a break now and probably do some barrows. A one. Ooh. Hello, Elite Clue Scroll, that's cool. Um, obviously haven't done one of these since I completed the last one, so the likelihood that I can do it is low, but I'm curious. What's the first step? We can do that! Let's get the ball rolling! Okay, uh, got a Sherlock Clue, this is probably gonna be my downfall, unfortunately. Yes! That's one of the few ones I can do, thank goodness. Oh, shit. Son of a sausage grip. What thieving level do you need for that? 72. Oh, man. That's gonna take forever. Well, I guess that gives me an excuse to train my thieving someday. Okay, so I need to train some thieving for that elite clue scroll. Um, I absolutely detest blackjacking, and I much prefer pyramid plunder despite the fact that it's slightly worse. Now, in order to do pyramid plunder, you kind of need to have access to that bank in Sophanom. In order to do that, you gotta do the contact, exclamation point quest. So, I'm gonna go do that quickly, it shouldn't take too long, and then I can use that bank. We'll get a Karis, good stuff. I did this quest as like a little kid, I remember, and I used melee, and it was super, super difficult. I'm using Ivan's Blast right now, and this is... <clears throat> this, this is extremely easy, as you can see. I've used Ivan's Blast for almost, like, every boss fight, and I'm telling you, this is really good if you haven't tried it out, so... One more hit, and this big boy will be dead. Go grab my Karis, and uh, that's pretty much the, uh, the quest completed. Just got level 60 thieving there, not too bad. Uh, at the moment, I'm getting, like, 55 KXP per hour, roughly. 
Uh, next level gets 61, that probably should give me a nice boost. I decided I'm probably not gonna go straight for 72, I'll rather go for like 68 and then boost the rest of the way, cause fuck thieving. He's probably gonna attack me, isn't he? You wanna rumble? <gasps> Splash the TB? Splash the TB? Share I TB'd! See you later. <laughs> I did not just get a rune spear. Oh, man. I'm pretty sure that's really rare. God dang it. That's so frustrating. Just give me my odium shard. Okay. So I'm mad. I'm not mad. I'm excited, but I'm mad. At the moment, OS Buddy Pro is down. So I currently have the regular client open. So when I saw this, I was like, holy shit, that's a black mask. And then I realized that my, uh, my screen capture is not the right size of this client, so this clip's gonna look all gross, but... Seriously? That's my third black mask in three cave horror tasks. Like, if you literally don't hate me yet, I... I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm sad you no longer like my videos, but... Holy crap. Okay, as you can tell, I'm finally back on OS Buddy, and there is my 100th task in a row. That is a massive point boost. Uh, let's get a new one quickly, and then we can kind of take a look at where we're at as far as points go. Fire Giants. You know, I was going to recycle that joke about my cousins from the south, but now it's just overdone. <laughs> anyway, 232 reward points. Uh, I think I need 400. Oh, I need 300 for rings, so we're pretty close to that. That's awesome. Oh, damn. Level 80 hit points. That's awesome. It's still blowing my mind. Like, this account's coming along pretty nicely in my eyes. 80 hit points. Alright, here we go. Tooth half? I don't want a tooth half. Why are we all, like, the same level? This is nuts. Come on, man! <laughs> okay, it's, it's unique. It's a unique. It's really gross, and I really don't want it. But hey, I'm an Iron Man. It's a unique. It could definitely be worse. Literally never again. Oh, Barrows. Why do you make me hate you? Why do you do this? Chest number 199. The Dragon Med Helm, god dang it. Just got 16 million total FP, that is awesome. Um, while I'm recording, we're currently at 67 thieving, about to get 68, and then that elite will be mine. Okay, there we go, there is the 72 boost right there. Gonna slowly but surely make my way there, and then, uh, I don't know what step we're currently on. Let me check the bank quickly. I'm gonna guess I will have a few more steps to do after this one, so... I don't know, man. I'm a little nervous. Like, if I have to do more steps, I'll be so upset. Six steps? Oh, that's not good. Okay. Uh, you know what? That was definitely a lot better than my first reward. I don't have a dragon mace, so I will gladly take that. The rest isn't too great, but hey, I guess this, this definitely could be worse. It was better than the first one. Holy shit! Let's freaking go! Oh my god! Oh my god! First kill of the trip! Oh yes! Oh yes! Oh, I'm so excited! Oh, I'm so freaking excited! Oh! <laughs> First kill of the trip, Dagonoth Rex kill count 105. The Berserker Ring has been achieved. Oh yes! I am so excited! You know, Zora, I'll tell you one thing. You're a real asshole. You know that? Well, my friends, I have bad news. I finally got the blue dehyde body clue scroll. Uh, I, as far as I'm aware, the only way you can get that is by making it, which requires 71 crafting. I am sad. Would you please do the honor, sir, of clicking that there casket? What? Where? Oh. Uh, the mouse is on it. Oh shit, okay. 
That there is a dark cavalier. You want to know why it's dark? Because it's dark. Because we're not fucking racist. Okay, uh, that's a Bandos Queef. Nice. Not bad. Nice. That's my only Bandos item right now, so that's actually really, really useful. It seems not that big of a deal, but like, this is gonna come in handy, so. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Um, I like it. Okay, I'm gonna have you open this Cusco. I think this could be the reward, if you would. Oh, shit! A green dragon mask. That's worth nothing but fashionscape. That's, that's awesome, man. Garrett, you're good luck. Sir, has no one taught you how to slayer? What are you doing? Okay, so what I need you to do right now is just go ahead and click on that casket. Now, don't drop it. Okay, Garrett. It's a good reward. We got a rune kite shield T. That's some good alchemals. All right. Catch it. Three, two, one. Ugh. Boom. That's how it's done, boys. <laughs> That's how it's done. Yep. All right, buddy. You got this. Oh, my Whoa. fucking God. That's my missing piece. Oh, my God, Garrett. <laughs> That's my missing Aram's piece. Holy cow, dude! What the heck? Oh, I'm so fired up. You are so... You're my good luck charm. Get the hell out of here. I have full Arabs now, other than the staff, of course, but... Wow! Alright, just finished up a run of Nightmare Zone. We are now over 650k points, and that means we can imbue this bad boy. God damn, that is awesome, guys. Eight strength bonus on a ring. That is... That is unbelievable. Okay, as soon as this thing dies, there we go. We should now have all the points we need to buy the ability to make the Slayer Rings. My final task, as you can see, you might not even know where I am right now. I got a task of Minions of Scarabus, or I have no idea, Scarabus, I have no, I don't know how the hell to say it. It is a terrible task, but I was like 8 points away and I just couldn't skip it, so. Anyways, let me go run to knee quickly, go buy that ability, and then we'll kind of talk about, you know, my crafting plans. Okay, so there's the ability to make Slayer Rings purchase. Now, making them is an entirely different matter. You need to have level 75 crafting to make them, which is a lot of levels. However, I do have a pretty genius plan in place. So what I'm going to do is buy these soda ash and buckets of sand to get me to 63 crafting. Now, at 63 crafting, you can start making green dehyde bodies. And earlier, I mentioned to you guys that I want to do the Mauritania Hard Diaries. And one of the requirements for that is 70 prayer. So what I'm going to do is kill green dragons for the dragon bones and the dehydes. The bones will get me all the way up to 70 prayer, and the dehydes will get me to 66 crafting. And at 66 crafting, I can start making air battle staves, which is a great money maker and great XP. So overall, this is actually like a really solid play. It'll come together very nicely. But anyways, guys, there we go. There is the Slayer Ring ability bot. Okay, so the green dragon grind has begun. We got a clue scroll already. I think they're relatively rare, but hopefully it'd be nice to get some good rewards throughout this process. Might be one of the more boring clue scrolls I've ever seen. Here, take this generic stuff. You all watch me click on that glory. Did you not? Oh? Oh, man. He fails. There we go. If I could escape, that'd be pretty nuts, actually. It's probably not gonna happen, but let me spec. Okay, let's just scream out what our plans are right now. <laughs> oh, he attacked his friend! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, I don't even care if I don't survive, dude. That's freaking hilarious. <laughs> oh god, he attacked his friend. I'm fucking dead, dude. That was so funny. I legitimately might not get away here, but... <laughs> I am so freaking close to the- oh. Come on. Come on. I'm literally so close to the edge. Please splash on me. Oh, I survived! Let's freaking go! GG! <laughs> oh, wait, I'm venomed, I'm venomed, I'm venomed, I'm venomed. Oh, I think I'm venomed. Oh. Other clue scroll. If you could actually allow me to do this one, that would be great. Oh, okay. A gothic stole armadal kite shield. I don't think I have a stole yet, so... 
you don't need this for another clue scroll, but I suppose this could have some implications, so not bad, I'll take it. Uh, somebody's informed me that you actually do need the stole for a hard clue scroll, so that is a great reward. Anyway, now we're good to go. No! What is with the weird items? It's a freaking episode! No! <laughs> Oh man, I can't complain. It's another freaking unique. That's my third out of four pieces of the Carol set. This episode we've had an Aram Sword and a Carol Coif now. God dang it. Since I bought the ability to make the Slayer Rings, I obviously didn't have any points left. So I'm kind of forced to do this Black Demon's Task, which is very slow, but fortunately enough, it's great XP. As you can see, we just got level 85 attack. Sorry, strength. That is insane. Um... Obviously my attack and defense are pretty far behind, everyone's been telling me to just keep on training strength until I get a whip, but I don't know, I feel like it'd be beneficial to like get 75 attack or something, at least speed it up slightly. Wow, that is a lot of freaking items in one clue scroll, but we get in, a, in, in one clue scroll, in one chest, I've never seen it go to this row, but we get an elite clue scroll, let's go. Sherlock, please... Fuck. So I finally finished my awful task, and I can't skip. Oh, God. I can't skip this no matter what it is. Please, God. Well, with my current stats, that won't take too long, but it's still not very good. Okay, this should be the final task after this, and we will be unlocking 72 Slayer and Wyverns. Need you give me something good, please? That's literally an awful task. If you don't know, spiritual creatures are whatever spiritual creatures you can slay. The only ones I can kill... Oh my god, I can kill warriors and I just skipped that. Since when can I kill warriors? Oh... Well, now I know for future reference. Fuck! And there we go, just got level 72 Slayer here on my favorite task, Controls. We can now kill Wyverns, that is going to make a massive difference in my account. I mean, I would start listing drops, but literally Wyverns have, every single drop they have is useful in my account, so definitely going to camp those in the near future. Let's go ahead and head over there right now, do a few celebratory kills, maybe get a message, you never know. Okay, there we go, there's our first one killed, which is actually a hard diary requirement. Got a rune battle axe. Pretty good, man. Pretty good. Alright, guys. Well, that is going to be it for this episode. Before I go, though, I really quickly want to touch on the elite clue scroll that I got earlier. Now, if you saw, I need to fletch a U longbow. A U longbow requires 60 fletching. Got a clue scroll. You know what? We're putting this in the video. Be right back. Oh, damn. That's a nice reward, too. Rune full helm T, bandos, plate legs. Another bandos item I can use. Nice. Okay, that's really awesome. Even better way to end the episode. Uh, there's the clue, guys. Let me uh, kind of wrap up that thought, though. Again, I need to get 65 fletching, then boost the rest of the way. I'm going to do that through Kingdom of Miscellanea. Problem is, I don't have a big enough cash stack for that right now, so gonna carry on making money, as you can see, by doing things like clues, because they make bank on alkables. Uh, keep on doing clues and such. Get my bank going, and we will finally have those maple logs, and uh, that's the plan anyways. Since I'm at the bank, let's go ahead and carry on the recording. Take a look at my overall bank value right now. 50 mil on the dot. Oh my god, that is so sick. 50 freaking mil on the dot. Uh, 1452 total level. Amazing, amazing episode, guys. We got that Berserker ring. We finished off the Aram set, well, other than the staff. We got the Gross Carol's crossbow, and we got one other item, didn't we? Aram's hood. Yeah, the Aram's hood, <laughs> the Carol's coif, the Aram's rope top, the Berserker ring. We got 72 Slayer, can now kill Wyverns. Just overall, amazing gains on this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, feel free to hit that like button down below. I seriously appreciate all of your guys' feedback. Take it easy, my friends. I will see you all later.